getting out of the void, the dreaded blank sheet of paper, a case study, one of five. Welcome to my web class. Logo, brand design, multi-purpose marketing vehicles. Original Marketing Strategies I'm going to take you step by step through the creative process to creating a logo, brand that can not only create an impression but can make your business additional revenue from designing using these strategies. I will show you how to create your own brand identity that can breathe more life into your company's logo, brand, by creating a personality that will create original marketing strategies. Which I call MMVs, Multi-Purpose Marketing Vehicles. The brief. First of all, the brief has to be precise, otherwise the design strategy will not answer or reach the desired outcome. The first step is getting out of the void, the dreaded blank sheet of paper. Research is key. I do this by following a simple chart. I draw, scribble and write notes. Research is key. Whatever you come across that's of interest, you must note it down for future reference. I make my notes in a hardback book so I can use it to go over my findings whenever I want, separately from the computer. Alongside these notes, I have many separate sheets of A4 paper that I write on too. When I want to get a basic idea of what an item, function or device is, I usually go to my local library and look it up first in the children's section. The reason is the description is simple to ascertain and it gives me a quick take on the subject. If I need more, I go in more depth, specialist books and the internet too. One list is just general association. Sky, water, rain, cloud, sunset, bird, aeroplane and so on. The second list is to find links, connections, things in common like sky, air, breath. Wind, light, reflection, shadow, and perhaps wordplay, quotes, random stuff, and sayings like red sky at night, shepherd's delight, as the crow flies. A bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. Raining cats and dogs. Of course, these phrases will differ from culture to culture. The third list is novelties for marketing. Any ideas that come about through the notes and simply writing anything and everything that for whatever reason pops into your mind. Start to write anything and everything, no matter what. Anything that comes to mind or comes into your head, even if you think, what did I think of that for? You never know where a logo, marketing or PR strategy will come from. So I mean anything, good, bad or indifferent, sometimes a negative can be used as a positive. Competitors. 
What are your competitors doing? This is so you do something completely different. How have your competitors approached their logo brand design, plus their marketing and PR? How to be different. To explain this simply is to view a sports crowd. Imagine a crowded sports stadium where all the spectators are dressed in blue. Now imagine a person in a bright yellow coat walking through the crowd. You would notice the entire journey that person travelled. What design concepts are you using now? I have included this in the chart that states the obvious, which is, what are you or your client doing presently? Is your media image reflecting your company's full potential for getting noticed in the marketplace? Case study. Here is a case study. The brief was verbal. I voice record the brief so I can listen to the client's own words over and over. The client, more often than not, will say something that is key to the design. After all, they know their business. In the conversation, the marketeer said that the company was evolving, which really hit me as a potential image to play with. Example, case study. Core business, filtration units for white goods. Fridges, freezers, cookers, washing machines and dishwashers. Example, case study. Brief. One, create a new company name. Two, Design a new, exciting logo brand. 3. Create a logo brand that will engage existing and potential buyers with a new brand image. 4. To target the buyers. 5. Business to business. 6. To be used on corporate identity, promotional material and fleet livery. Here is a sample of some of the logo brand designs I've done over the years. Watch all five of my web class videos. Each one contains useful information. Try not to be a short-sighted client or working for one. It will affect your portfolio of work. I hope you enjoyed the first of the five videos. The next two videos are how to make an association list. The fourth is about connections. The fifth and final video is about shape play, fine tuning and coming up with a company name, PR and marketing ideas for your MMVs. Well, if you've got this far, well done. My name is Tim Harris. I'm a dyslexic designer and qualified teacher. I spent over 40 years in the design 
advertising and marketing industry. Working for many of the world's top agencies, directly or indirectly, as a freelance artist, designer and creative director. I have just recently got involved in art directing music videos too.